All right, who is this? Wait, hold on. He's standing behind his mom? That is some crazy stuff. Say it be hurt and hit her cervix. I'm not damaging. Had her on her back. I made her tap like she's a rack. Like, like, damn, I know karma is coming type thing. But, you know, the other people that was on there that was just rapping loosely, they just like, uh, it just sounds sweet. So I'm gonna go ahead and rap about it. No being just pre up big back man in Bam from a big cat local Torn up an X-Men's local Put off working all of my jaws Like how many jaws in total And how many times are a babe man squat your punk If you fit that's Don't you go his mum protected him you know Alright who is this Standing behind his mum and that Wait hold on He's standing behind his mom. That is some crazy stuff Right so They at the mall Just imagine that You shopping with your mom. You at the mall Right Y'all walking, all you hear is, hey, yo, Adam, come, come here, here. Yee. Right? right? So they start chasing you and your mom getting away. I really hope nothing happened to his mom at all. I really hope nothing happened to his mom. Sneaks, MPK. Let me ask y'all a question. So let's just say if y'all lived in that apartment, right? Let's just say y'all was on the fifth floor and they were shooting a video right there, right? Now, you walking, you about to get ready to go up the stairs, right? And one of them yell out, hey, come on. You go come on or you go run? What you gonna do? Would you ask to be in the video? All right, Sneaks also lived what he rapped about. He wasn't the only one who didn't snitch and kept it real in the K1WG murder case. Okay, damn, he, uh, he solid. Solid guy, solid dude. Fake OSAF? Really? And honestly, look at by, by judging at that Parker, I would think otherwise. I would really think he's really about something because when you got that big ass pocket like that. Just think about it. You got that big ass Parker. You you walking. I don't know from school one day, or you walking to the store, or whatever the case may be. You see that big ass Parker, and somebody yell out. I'm pretty sure y'all know. I'm gonna go ahead and let y'all finish it. Yeah, hey off and they yell that out, right? Let's just say he yells that out. I would be terrified. I'd probably piss myself. I would run away. But oh, Sav, it seems like he really is what he rap about. I thought the bigger the Parker, the more ops that they had, and the more men that they had on their blade. Hell, let's see here. Okay, although oh, Sav wasn't a rapper, uh, he was one of the most OJ in MPK. However, this changed when he snitched on the K1 case, and maybe the reason everyone got birded. Damn. So because of him, he's the reason that everyone went to jail. Or does Birdit mean went to jail or got nicked or got chefed? Whatever. Well, I'm, I mean, I'm guessing snitched is self-explanatory, so they probably in jail. No, I have to laugh when I hear these songs. They're lyrical artists. Tell me I'm wrong. No station talking, crime scene, long shot. Jiggy J, boom, your life is gone. Foul. Foul. Free blood body try making my life off. All right, man, there you have it, UK Drill Rappers versus Fake Rappers Part 1. In all honesty, man, looks can be very, very deceiving just because of the simple fact, like, I thought all of these guys were really about it. You know what I'm saying? Judging by the parkas and judging by the mask all over their face and stuff like that, you will really think they was out here chef and sh and sh and sh and sh. You really thinking they putting pressure on people. You really think they out here tormenting people, yelling, hey, yo, um, so... Honestly, when I do decide to come to the UK, I have no reason to really be terrified. Just because of the simple fact, some people that's saying that is wet, is moist. They not even go do anything. So it ain't even no point why I should be running. Honestly, I just thought about it after looking at this video. I have no fear. I'm not scared of you guys. It's like, no, I'm lying. I'm lying. Some of them, some of y'all I am scared of. So, um, but anyway, man, uh, comment down below and let me ask you guys a question. Do you really think street credit matters? Do you really think, do you really think that UK drill rappers need to rap about what they live? 
Or do you think like, hmm, if it sounds good, I'ma just listen?